Carlisle. The doctor will be with you shortly. Right, Mr. Carlisle. Right. Mr. Carlisle, the doctor will be with you sh shortly. Mr. Right, Mr. Car Mr. Carlisle, the doctor will be with you shortly. Mr. Carlisle, you know? <laughs> <laughs> right. Mr. Carlisle, Dr. Wilson, sure. I, I, I got this. I got this. Fuck it. Let's just do this again. <laughs> Mike! <laughs> Go, Chris. Yeah, boy. Mr. Carter, I... Mr. Carlisle, how are we doing today? Okay, um, looking at your chart, uh, guess your everything's been good, just in for a routine checkup, is that right? Okie dokie. Um, now, if you could, uh, just take off that shirt for me. <laughs> Little strange. Weird guy asking you to get undressed. But hey, we're just two guys trying to make our bodies better. Woo! In a professional way. <laughs> right. Okay, uh, now cough for me. <coughs> right in the face. Lungs sound good. Uh, you can put your shirt back on. <laughs> <laughs> Should I dim the lights and set the mood? Sorry, both hands. No cancer in that scrotum. <laughs> Train coming too frequently. Toot toot goes the train. <laughs> How was your flatulence? Oh, it's fine. Thanks for asking. Uh, change your diet? Yeah, you know what did it? The eggplant. The eggplant. I know, I told you. Yeah, I said to the wife, honey, that eggplant can't do it. You have the gas again. You want to know a little secret? Whenever you go to a restaurant and you really want an eggplant parmesan, just order chicken instead. You can still order eggplant parmesan, but just make sure they substitute chicken for the albergine. That's pretty clever. Let's call it chicken parm. <laughs> Hello? Again? All right, nurse, I'll be right out. I'm sorry, there's an emergency in the waiting room. I'll be right back. All right, finally, I can set up my explosive gas and kill that infernal doctor. No more. Cold hands, no more coughing, no more witty banter about my rectum and its medical maladies. Finally, the world will take my activism seriously. For years, I've attended protests, made incendiary blog posts, and no one has listened. Finally, with the death of this prominent doctor, people will know about the dangers of Medicare and Medicaid. And tell her to keep her fingers out of there. Nothing in, nothing out. No silverware? No, nothing! <laughs> Sorry about that. Uh, where were we? Um, oh, the eggplant. And the flatulence is all gone? No uh, burning sensation anymore? No, Doc, the burning sensation is gone. But you're about to experience a burning more painful and more profound than you can ever imagine. I thought we just talked about this. No more eggplant. <laughs> <laughs> is it something else? Is it your lungs? Is it your heart? Is it your penis? It's bigger than me! It's bigger than all of us! Oh, you're talking about the bomb? What? And the bomb. You're literally pointing to it with your finger. You think I didn't see it? You probably set it up while I was just out in the hallway. Really, I'm not stupid. I went to Harvard Med. The Crimson? The Crimson Tide? Wait, you mean Alabama? Woo! <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>